हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू आई एम एस गेट अकेडमी एज यू ऑल नो दैट गेट ट्वेंटी फोर इंस्ट्रूमेंटेशन एग्जाम वॉज ओवर ऑन फोर्थ फेब्रवरी ऑन दैट डे आफ्टर कंप्लीस ऑफ दैट एग्जाम वॉट एवर द मेमरी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन दैट वी हैव रिसीव फ्रॉम आवर स्टूडेंट्स हियर एट अवर आई एम एस गेट अकेडमी यूट्यूब चैनल ऑल अवर फैकल्टीज हैव डिस्कस द डिटेल सोल्यूशन एंड आंसर कीज फॉर दोज क्वेश्चन ओके सो आई होप ऑल ऑफ यू अटेंडेड दैट लाइव सेशन due to any reason if you have missed that session no issue at all whoever write in the gate 2024 exam either in ec paper or electrical paper on 11th february 2024 so all of you kindly watch that session in your free time it is very much helpful for all those students okay so in this particular session i am going to discuss the detailed analysis of gate 2024 instrumentation paper and the expected cut off marks regarding this particular paper this particular information is very much helpful for all the students who have written the gate 2024 instrumentation paper right so i hope all of you are eagerly waiting for the session so let us start so regarding general aptitude most of the questions they have given easy and two or three questions they have given tough from the subject general aptitude regarding engineering maths around 12 marks they have given and regarding network theory around 6 marks they have given regarding signal sense system control systems as usual around 8 marks they have given and regarding signal sense system and control system subjects whatever the important concepts are there standard models are there from those models only they have asked the questions okay and regarding digital circuit subject in general the weightage of this subject is around 8 marks in fact in instrumentation paper digital along with microprocessor the weightage will be around 10 to 12 marks okay but in this particular year regarding digital and regarding network theory subjects these two subjects the weightage come little down okay so regarding digital and microprocessor together around 5 marks they have given and regarding analog circuits most of the questions they have given from the standard models like mosfets op amps etc okay and those questions are very easy questions and few questions interestingly in this particular paper they have combined the concepts of analog circuits and transducers okay and similarly some questions they have combined they have framed with the two subjects like network theory and measurements okay see in general in general they will frame the in the gate exam you will get the questions like some questions will be purely based on the respect to subject okay some questions will be combination of two subjects okay but in this paper one of the surprise is they have framed the some questions based on two subjects but but one subject is common for all the branch okay all the three branches like ec electrical in and another subject is like from electrical or from instrumentation like say for example some questions they have framed from network theory and and measurements and some question they have framed from the analog circuits and transducer okay so those questions say for example the questions based on network theory and measurements only electrical students can answer because they are having the knowledge of both network theory and measurements concepts okay and whoever having the knowledge of transducers that means whoever the students from instrumentation only those students can answer the questions based on the questions which are framed on analog and transducer right so the, this is the one of the big surprise in this particular gate 2024 in paper okay and one more surprise is as i mentioned earlier regarding network theory and digital in general regarding network theory the weightage will be around 8 marks regarding digital and microprocessor the weightage is around 10 to 12 marks but surprisingly in this particular year from these two subjects the weightage come down okay in general for ec electrical in together we are having total seven subjects which are common for all the three branches okay whoever prepared these three subjects these three common subjects these three branches common subjects whoever prepared thoroughly they can score easily good number of marks but in this particular year regarding network theory and digital they have given little bit regarding the number of marks they have given little bit down okay and next one regarding measurements around 8 marks they have given regarding transducer around 10 marks they have given and regarding communication they have given around 3 marks and machines around 4 marks okay and optical around 4 marks they have given and process control they have given around 2 marks okay 
So this is regarding the subject wise analysis of GATE 2024 instrumentation paper. Okay. Now let us see with respect to variety of questions when compared to the previous years and this year. So regarding the, as you all know that in the GATE exam, we are having three types of questions. One is MCQ, only one option will be correct among the four choices. Whereas for MSQ, either one option or more than one option can be correct, right? So for MSQ and NAT, there is no native marking. For MSQ, there is no partial marking also, okay? So in the year 2023, regarding MSQ, only one and MCQ and NAT, if you observe, 31 questions MCQ and 33 questions are of NAT, okay? So in this 2024 IN paper, regarding MSQ one only, that question asked from the subject mathematics, engineering mathematics, okay? Regarding NAT in this year, only 18 questions, whereas for MCQ, 46 questions are there, okay? So now, I hope all of you are eagerly waiting what is what will be the expected cutoff in the gate 2024 instrumentation paper so as i mentioned see actually regarding this in general when you compare ec electrical and instrumentation papers so in general the in paper will be easy when compared to ec or electrical the reason is for all the three branches seven subjects are common in the instrumentation paper okay so for all the three branches ec electrical in so seven subjects are common, but in this particular year, as I mentioned earlier, regarding digital and network theory subjects, these two subjects, because they have given less number of questions from these two subjects, because of that only, because of that only, one only, either EC students or electrical students may not score more than some marks, okay? Okay, otherwise they could have scored more number of marks because in general from digital or network those two subjects are the basic subjects and scoring subjects easily ec and electrical students they can easily score the marks from those two subjects okay along with signals controls etc maths general aptitude etc but only that is one of the uh, main factor or bottleneck happened in this particular year so that is based on that based on that and here whatever the common subjects are there okay out of seven subjects whatever the most of the questions whoever prepared thoroughly right whether you are from ec or electrical or in okay whoever thoroughly prepared they can easily score 40 marks whoever e even in the gate exam along with those questions whoever attempted the typical questions like as i mentioned earlier networks and measurements that combination or analog and transducer those combination questions whatever the typical questions are there whoever solved those questions correctly right those students they can easily score okay uh, around 50 marks are easily cross 50 marks easily okay so in general like last year regarding instrumentation paper the cutoff mark is 34 marks okay so overall if you consider regarding this particular in 2024 paper so overall difficulty wise it is like moderate okay so that's why i can say that Regarding IN paper in 2024, the cutoff will be around 30 marks, okay? I am not saying it will be 34 because as I mentioned earlier, because two scoring subjects, from those two scoring subjects in this paper, they have given somewhat less number of weightage. So that is the reason, okay? But whoever thoroughly prepared, either you are from EC or electrical or IN, whoever attempted good number of questions, they can easily score 40 marks as I mentioned earlier. So based on that, I can say that the cutoff mark for this particular gate IN paper will be around 30 marks. And in fact, in this year, along with IN students, even EC students and electrical students also, they have they have also attempted this paper. And, and I hope all the EC and electrical and IN students, whoever attempted this paper, all of you got great experience from this particular paper. And with this, okay, so whoever writing EC and electrical paper on the coming Sunday, that is on 11th February, you people can perform very well, okay? So whoever, whoever got the marks which you have already expected, okay? So it's very fine. By this time, all of you are very happy, but some of you might not be happy because whatever the expected marks from the IN paper, okay? So whoever couldn't score that many marks, okay, whoever not reached your expectation level, no issue at all, okay, whatever the opportunities are there, 
okay whatever the gate marks you are getting with that gate marks whatever the available opportunities are there that we will cover in the upcoming sessions we are having post gate guidance series in those series we will discuss for every top institute of india like iits nits etc what are the various mtech programs they are offering and what are the specializations they are offering and what are the last year cut off marks or cut off scores etc all those details we will provide you in those sessions so that all of you can watch those sessions in our youtube channel at our ims get academy youtube channel so that all of you will get the awareness whatever the marks you have got okay so getting the marks say for example whoever got above 60 marks in the iron paper definitely they will get very good rank right whoever got around 50 marks around 40 marks and whoever qualified in the iron paper whatever the marks you are getting with those marks whatever the available opportunities you are having that you should be aware okay once if you have the awareness then only you can utilize the best opportunity that you are going to get with your gate marks okay so all those details we will be sharing in detail in the upcoming series regarding post gate guidance so all of you kindly watch those sessions in your free time for that all of you can subscribe our youtube channel and click on the bell icon so that you won't miss even single video okay so not but not the least i hope by this time most of you might have joined our telegram channel whoever not yet joined so kindly join our telegram channel in your free time regarding this particular channel link it is provided in the description of this particular video so that whatever the upcoming live events live sessions are happening in our youtube channel so all those sessions updates okay you will get in our telegram channel okay so whoever writing the gate gate exam gate 2024 exam in ec or electrical paper on 11th february so for all those students wish you all the very best from our ims gate academy so i hope all of you can perform very well okay so thank you everyone